hi and welcome back to the channel thank you so much for clicking into this video so in this video i'm going to teach you how to open dll files make sure that you stay until the very end of this video so you don't miss any important step for information and without further ado let's get on it so to open the, your DLL files, first you just need to determine the use of the DLL file. So DLL files usually run in background while you use Windows programs. So a single DLL file may often or often have several functions that it can perform, which the programs may access in order to perform that function. So some functions that a DLL file may have include drawing graphics, displaying text, managing fonts, and then making calculations. And next step we had here is to find a program that can open a DLL file and follow the steps to open the file. So I have here, so there are different or there are few programs that can open DLL file. So Windows computers already have a registry program where you can register DLL files. Visual Studio or a compiler are both programs that you can download to read your DLL files. While Visual Studio Online lets you look at DLL files without downloading or finding a program ahead of time. So right here, what I'm going to show you in the next slide or next part of this video are four methods that you can follow to open a DLL file. So for the first one, we have the Microsoft Windows 7 and a newer registry. So below are the steps that may help you open a DLL file on the Windows 7 computers and newer. So first, just open the command prompt. So you can open the command prompt by going to the Windows Start menu or by holding the Windows key plus R and typing CMD or command in the prompt that appears on screen. And after that, open the folder with DLL file. So once you find the folder, hold the Shift key and right-click the folder to open the command prompt directly in that folder. And then just simply type REGSVR32 then the name of that file or the dll file that dll and press enter so this function can add the dll file to your windows registry helping you access your dll file and you may use this function to add a new dll files to your computer and then after that just type regsvr32 again and then dash u and then the dll file name file and then that dll and press enter so this function can remove a dll file from the registry and you may use this to remove dll files that are not behaving properly so those are all the steps that you need to do to, to help you open dll file or windows 7 computers and newer and then we have the microsoft windows visual studio so um, I'm not going to guide or read through all of this step right here, but what you can do is to pause this video and just follow the steps at your own time. So again, we have here the Microsoft Vid Windows Visual Studio, and then we have the Visual Studio Online, and then lastly, we have the compiler program. And so that's it for this video and I hope this helped you. And if it did, please make sure to like, subscribe, and hit notification bell button so you don't miss a video. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.